Kumusta na kayo mga kids? Tayo ngayon ay nasa week 5. This time ang ating topic, perform addition and subtraction of similar and dissimilar fraction and solving routine and non-routine word problems. Halina kayo, samahan niyo ako sa ating video. In the previous lesson, you have learned how to add and subtract similar fractions. This time, you are going to apply what you have learned from this lesson. After going through this lesson, you are expected to solve routine and non-routine problems involving addition and subtraction of fractions using appropriate problem-solving strategies and tools. Read and analyze the problem below. Look how the problem below solve using the following steps. Mario painted his doghouse using 5-6 liter of yellow paint and 2 thirds liter of red paint. What color of paint was used more than the other? By how much more? To understand what is asked, the paint color that was used is more than the other. What are the given facts? 5-6 liter of yellow paint and 2 thirds liter of red paint. Plan. Let's draw a picture. Ito ang 5-6. Tutuloy natin yan later. Identify the operation to be used. Subtraction. Write the number sentence. 5, 6 minus 2 thirds equals N. For solution, 5, 6 and 2 thirds, ito ay dissimilar fraction. So, i-change natin ito sa similar fraction. Kunin natin ang kanyang equal fractions at yan ay 5, 6 and 4, 6 so 5, 6 minus 4, 6 equals 1, 6 so ituloy natin ang drawing that is 5, 6 binawasan ng 2 thirds or 4, 6 the answer is 1, 6 so the answer is Yellow paint for the question, what color of paint was used more than the other? By how much more? By 1 6 liter. For learning task 1, read its problem, then solve. Write your answer in your notebook. Number 1 question. Mrs. Susan bought 3 pips meter of curtain cloth. She used 1 8 meter to make a curtain for the living room window. How many meters of cloth were not used? So, ang tinatanong, meters of cloth were not used. Para masolve ang problem, we need to subtract 1 8 from 3 pips. Kaya, 3 pip minus 1 8. First, kunin muna ang LCD ng 5 at saka 8. Ang multiples ng 5 ay 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. Ang multiples of 8 ay 8, 16, 24, 32, 40, 48, and so on. Kaya naman, ang LCD natin ay 40. So, ang ating bagong denominator is 40. So, alamin natin ang numerators. 40 divided by 5 equals 8 times 3 equals 24. Yung sunod, 40 divided by 8 equals 5 times 1 equals 5. So, let us subtract 24 
minus 5 equals 19, then copy denominator 40. So the answer is 19 over 40. For learning task 2, read and solve the following problems. Write your answer in your notebook. Sagutan din natin ang number 1. A seller sliced some pizzas into eights. After selling 57 slices, 7 slices were left. How many whole pizzas did the vendor slice? So ang tinatanong ay ilang buong pizza ang na-slice ng vendor. Para makuha natin ang sagot, let us add 57 slices at ang 7 slices na natira. So, 57 over 8 plus 7 over 8. Let us add 57 plus 7 equals 64 and copy denominator 8. To simplify, 64 divided by 8 equals 8. So, how many whole pizzas? There are 8. For number 2 question, the Boy Scouts spend 10-12 hours doing their daily exercises. They only used one fourth hour in hiking. How much time did they use for other body exercises? Para masolve ang ating problem, we need to subtract 10 twelves minus 1 fourth. Una, kunin natin ng LCD ng 12 and 4. Multiples of 12, 12 and 24, and so on. While 4, 4, 8, 12. At ang LCD natin ay 12. So, ang ating bagong denominator is 12. So, let's know what are the numerators. So, 12 divided by 12 equals 1. Times 10 equals 10. 12 divided by 4 equals 3 times 1 equals 3. So, let us subtract 10 twelves minus 3 twelves equals 7 twelves. So, ang sagot po ay 7 twelves. Para sa learning task 3, read and solve its problem. Write your answer in your notebook. Number one question, Mrs. Lasso bought 9 and 1 8 meter of curtain cloth. She used 3 and 5 6 meter to make a curtain for their bedroom. How many meters of cloth were not used? So, inaalam natin ilang meters yung hindi nagamit. So, ating isubtract ang 9 and 1 8 minus 3 and 5 6. Bago yan, kunin muna natin ng LCD ng 8 and 6. Ang mga multiples ng 8, ang multiples ng 6, at ang kanilang LCD ay 24. So, ang bagong denominators ay 24. So, i-change na natin ito sa similar fractions. 24 divided by 8 equals 3 times 1 equals 3. Then, 24 divided by 6 equals 4 times 5 equals 20. Ating isubtract. Pwede bang isubtract? Hindi pwede. Kasi mas malaki ang fractions ng subtrahen kisa sa minuen. Kaya ang ating gagawin, i-rename natin ang 9 and 3 over 24. Ito ay magiging 8 and 24 over 24. Idagdag natin ng 3 over 24. At yan ay magiging 8 and 27 over 24. Ngayon, isubtract na natin ang 3 and 20 over 24. 
Kaya naman, 8 minus 3 equals 5. 27 minus 20 equals 7. Then, copy denominator, 20. Kaya ang ating sagot, sa tanong na how many meters of cloth were not used, the answer is 5 and 7, 20 ports. Maraming salamat sa inyong pananood. Huwag kalimutang mag-subscribe, mag-comment, pwedeng i-share, at mag-like. Hanggang sa susunod pa natin mga videos, hanggang sa muli, paalam!